So I just wanted to address this. <clears throat> there are many people who, I, or many YouTubers I see that will make a video um, asking what is fascism or are the Nazis fascists? And they will say no and yes. Now, I need to clear this up. Or, or, and I will also address that people call, you know, neocons and Trumpists and conservatives and Republicans fascists and why I think that's beyond silly. Um, more silly than what's on the face of it. Um, are Nazis fascists? No. The fascists was the National Socialist Party, um, that formed in Italy. You could say it's the first National Socialist Party. And then the Nazis took that and mixed in, you know, ideas of race and, you know, all this other weird stuff. And they created the Nazi Party. Or I should say the Germans took that and mixed in, you know, weird ideas of race. There was no anti-Semitism or racism in the fascist party of Italy. And then you have the Flankists of um, Spain, which people call them fascists, even though they were the National Socialists of Spain, and they were more like the Italians, but also very anti-imperialistic and um, very Catholic, uh, whereas the uh, National Socialism as it is, it really does not like religion, um, especially Christianity, and especially Catholicism. So no, the Nazis aren't fascists. They're national socialists, and the fascists are also national socialists, and they... The fascists were the national socialists of Italy, and people like to say, oh, well, anything that's a national socialist is a fascist. And then they use Nazis as their template for fascism, which is really stupid. Um... And they say, oh, um, there's anti-Semitism and, um, and, uh, what's it called? And racism intrinsic to fascism, which no, there's not. Um, in fact, uh, in Italy, there were many Jewish fascists and, um, the anti-Semitism stuff didn't come in until Hitler basically forced the issue, and even then, the Italian fascists really dragged their feet and and actually hid some Jews. Um, <clears throat> and or they'll say, and I don't know where I get this, where you know, very religious, you know, oligarchies or whatever are fascist. Fascism is 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 di di dialectical materialism, just like communism. It, it, there's no room for religion in there. Unless you, you know, force it in, just like how Nazis forced in, you know, racism. Now, why do I see uh, calling Republicans fascist uh, as just beyond silly? Because between the Democrats and the Republicans, the Democrats, if anybody, who has more in common with fascism? Well, it would be the Democrats or even the Green Party because they want things like universal basic income, universal health care, stuff like with stuff that fascists. Um, they were not international socialists. They were national socialists. So they would, all that big government stuff they'd be for. Um, people who call the Republicans fascists, I, I don't know where they're getting this from. Or the conservatives. Oh, conservatives are pro-war. That means they're fascist. The fascists had a militarized system to get their country going, but it's not actually not imperialistic. Or, I mean, Hitler made it imperialistic, so he really wasn't a national socialist. He was an international German socialist. That's where the racism came in. Uh, so, yeah, it's silly. If, if you were going to... The closest one to fascism would be the Democrats. But... Again, not all the fascists' ideas were wrong or evil. Um, now, if you're an atheist I, and you're not keen on democracy like a lot of the Antifa people are, I don't understand how the Antifa people 
are they they just call their enemies fascists but they themselves everything they advocate for including their tactics are like a one-to-one -one with fascism it's so strange and even their race stuff it, it seems to almost mirror um not even just fascism but the national socialism of the nazis i mean it's 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 pretty weird all right peace to you